a storybook by Johnny Duty called Gigantosaurus. Look at those dinosaurs. Wow. Ooh. Gigantosaurus. Gigantosaurus. Johnny Doodle. Many million years ago, beyond the path of the lava flow, on the edge of the jungle where the herbivores grazed, four little dinosaurs spent their days playing in the Cretaceous sun, following tracks and having fun. Beware, my child, says the dinosaur mom. Of the Gigantosaurus, so fierce and wild. With teeth as long as you are tall, he'd soon make a snack of one so small. His feet go stomp, his jaws go crunch. In the blink of an eye, you'd be his lunch. Bonehead Tiny, Finn and Bill, went off to play up on the hill. Bonehead Tiny. The Gigantosaurus was in their minds till Bonehead said, I think you'll find we need a lookout and I'm the best. I'll get a good view from that termite nest. Termite nest. But it was only a minute before Bonehead cried. It's the Gigantosaurus. Quick, run and hide. Thud, thud, thud. They ran, they hid, they shook with fear. The Gigantosaurus was coming near. Ooh, look how big you can see his horns. There was no stomp, there was no crunch, no fierce monster had smelled his lunch. It's just triceratops, Bonehead declared. You ran, you hid, you were all so scared. Hello, Dad. Hello, son. But you passed my emergency warning trial. Now I'll keep watch from that rock a while. But a little bit later, Bonehead cried, The Gigantosaurus, quick run and hide. Boom, boom, boom. They ran, they hid, they shook with fear. The Gigantosaurus was coming near. It's big, see the feet. But there was no stomp, there was no crunch, no hungry beast after snacks to munch. It's old. Diplodocus, Bonehead declared. You ran, you hid, you were all so scared. But danger lurks, as you need to learn. I'll look out from that enormous fern. It didn't take long till he heard a shout. Gigantosaurus, you'd better watch out. Thunk, thunk, thunk. They ran, they hid, they shook with fear. The Gigantosaurus was coming near. But there was no stomp, there was no crunch, no carnivore with the whiff of lunch. It's the Stegosaurus, Bonehead declared. You ran, you hid, you were all so scared. But at least you passed my final test. Now I'll take a nap in that comfy nest. Ten seconds later, they cry again. Gigantosaurus, run as fast as you can. 
But all those friends heard what a bonehead cried. By now they knew that bonehead lied. That's it, said Bill. We're off to explore, and we're not going to play with you anymore. With everyone gone, Bonehead was alone. He began to wish he was back home because an awful noise was coming near, and now there was good reason for fear. The feet went stomp. There's the feet. Ooh, crunch. And the Gigantosaurus had his lunch. Look how big. Ooh. Bonehead's friends came running back after they heard the tree go crack. Poor old Bonehead, it's such a shame. What a sad end to his naughty game. Even though he tricked and lied, at least he taught us how to hide. But then they heard a muffled cry from the scraps of nest that lay nearby. I'm here, it's me, I survived. I'm sorry that I tricked and lied, but this time, honestly, it's true. There's the... Parentodon, after you. And though Bonehead thought they'd run in fright, his friends just shrugged and said, Yeah, all right. Meet the dinosaurs in this book. Uh huh. Paraceralopus palaeontologist, scientists who study ancient animals and plants, think this dinosaur's large crest was used to make sounds. Triceratops had a huge skull, one third the length of its whole body. And the Ankylosaurus, a full grown adult, could weigh five to six tons. Stereosaurus spike tail is called thagomizer. Bronchosaurus were huge herbivores. Tiny moms will grow to be even bigger than Dipopolis. Pteranodon were flying reptiles. This one. <laughs> I can't say that word. But Bonehead couldn't pronounce that. Me neither. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god. The Diplodocus. This giant dinosaur had a comically tiny brain. Like me. <laughs> the end. <laughs>